I didn't see you. And so today, um, reading is going to be my topic. Uh, I want to talk about books, and I'm going to show you my library. To start off, we'll start with some of my favorite books. I'm sure you recognize this. Mikey had it in his video. This is my John Green box set, and my favorite book of all time is The Fault in Our Stars. This wonderful blue one right here. All of them are great, but that one's my favorite. The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, which I'll pull out for you. Um, this one is the more than complete Hitchhiker's Guide. This book came out in the early 90s, before the mid 90s when the fourth book came out, so it's not really as complete as you'd think. I also have some paperbacks of that series, and I have it on my Kindle because I really like it. This is my book collection. We got a Bible and some collected um, plays or something. And then here, and these were in alphabetical order until they got moved around. So you got A's here, B's here, start with C's over here. And here's my Creighton section. Um, the Andromeda Strain, Two Pirate Latitudes. I don't have all of them, but I have most of his books. Over here, I have some more, some Faulkner, Gaiman. Down here, I'm getting into the G's. This is my White Stripes biography. Abraham Lincoln, Vampire Hunter. And over here, you start with my Stephen King section, which is admittedly the largest section in my library. I like Stephen King. You have more Stephen King, more Stephen King, more Stephen King. Dean Koontz, who is awful. And then some more assorted books. I have some more books up here. You see, originally I had all my books alphabetized, but then I went away and my parents moved around my room for some reason. And, uh, I mean, it's really nice. They, like, cleaned it and stuff, so that's cool. But they, my mom decided that instead of by alphabetical, by author, and then chronological, by date released, she put it by size, and I've been trying to rearrange them back into the proper way, but apparently that hasn't gotten really gone yet. Then here are, um, is my stack of books that I got for Christmas. Got some Cusslers, and then a bunch of pretentious smart people books, because my uncle wants me to make me pretentious and smart. Uh, right now I'm going down these stairs because I need to show you the rest of my book collection which incidentally is not in my room. Someday I hope to have a room like Alaska Young filled with books. Now these books are the books that I've already read. Don't feel like I have my bookshelf as you can they as you may be able to see. I got all my Harry Potters here. Um, Twilight's you. Anyway, I have all my books here. Not only are they double stacked, I have the whole Warrior series behind there. Not only are these books double stacked, there's a stack, and then there's another stack of books behind them. But there's books on top of the books, more comic books and stuff. Oh, and there's more books over here. So that's my book collection. Books are great. So, somewhere in this video, you can find an annotation where you can find a special link. Special link! A special link. A special link and that special link will bring you to a special video. Special video. And the special video will be of me and I will not tell you what I'm doing but I will give you a clue. Really on this video I talked about a lot of books and in those books there was a book that I had numerous copies of. Second paperback book. There you will find the annotation that will bring you to the special video hidden in this video. My retainer and mouth guard, a little flashlight thingy, my Kindle, a broken spoon from work, my buff from skiing, CDs I got for Christmas, some rechargeable batteries, ribbon, candy wrappers, cleat tips, CD player, pens, pens, notebook, my favorite YouTuber who's not John Hank, sexy nerd girl who I will put a link to in the description. And I have a question too. What was the last book you read? What is your favorite book? Holy crap, Blanches, I'm winning.